Well, Thanksgiving is a time for friends, family, and food. And so one local organization is making sure El Pasoans have all three. KTSM 9 News reporter Zach Say explains. Hi, Jose, how are you? The team behind the Borderland Rainbow Center up early Saturday morning giving El Pasoans a reason to be thankful. Can you carry it? Yeah. <laughs> the center offers many services to all members of the Sun City, but especially to LGBTQ plus members. Julie Lucas and her team handed out 100 turkeys to their clients. Uh, this will probably be like one of the first uh, Thanksgivings that will be spending it at home and with a turkey in the oven. So it, it's, it really does mean a lot to me. None of which would be possible without the collaboration of local businesses. But we have a wonderful relationship with one of the local produce companies and they give us what are called their number twos, which is stuff that's just not pretty enough to sell. We go through it and we end up with a beautiful, huge crates full of vegetables that we give out twice a week. Although they were able to help some, the need is much greater. And unfortunately, I do have some people showing up that, you know, hoping that we had extra turkeys. And The center says they're always in need of canned protein, rice, and hygiene products, even more so during the holidays, reminding everyone that in giving, it's not just someone else who receives. I'm just thinking that, you know, giving out food and stuff, it helps the community, but my gosh, it helps me. And the Borderland Rainbow Center wants to remind you that if you need help, you can visit them on Mondays from 1 to 5 p.m. and on Fridays from 1 to 4 p.m. In Central El Paso, Zach Zay, KTSM 9 News.